let's talk about the Montreal school job. <coughs> Who remembers that? No, basically one of the saw is that Bridhart did not want to lose to Son Michaels in in his home country of Canada. Mm, yeah, who won? And that's the way I kind of I kind of agree with Bill on that. Why would you want to lose when you in your home state to a home country? And that's not right. Now, when Rick did agree to drop the belt to Michaels, but not in Canada. Then he'll probably do it the, the next night. Just let him keep the belt while they're in Canada. I know Vince wanted to drop the belt now. And, um, So basically, doing the mats. When Sam Michaels had the soft suitor, and those Brits on move. I'm sorry. And then Vince called for the referee to ring the bell. This angered Brit. So the way they turn around and he spat and Vince McMahon's face. Then of course there's also a way to a big heated argument in the backstage area. And for several years, Bret Hart, at that several years, Bret Hart was no longer in the WWE. Two several several years later, Robert Hart was finally inducted into the Hall of Fame. But but still we do not see that much of Brit in WWE today. You know, Brit might make a few appearances here and there. But recently Brit was at AEW on was was one of the AEW shows where they filled the belt. This will be this big race where we see more Brit in AEW yes. over Brit return to the WWE. So what are you guys' thoughts on the Montreal screw job? Was Brit in the right? Was WWE in the right? Were they both in the wrong? Let me know in the comments.